Let me hear ya! Introducing first into the next one ring, representing the red corner. Five feet ten inches tall, a very well-trained 185 pounds. He fights and trains for Jackson Submission Fighting. He has a master professional record of nine wins, two losses. He's come all the way to us from Australia. Please welcome Dan Death Row Higgins. Ladies and gentlemen, representing the Blue Corner, five feet nine inches tall, one hundred and eighty-five pounds. He's a boxer, cross-trained in Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu, a member of the Fight Clan Fight Team. He's a master professional record, nine wins, two losses. Please welcome to the X1 ring. Fernando, the Maniac Gonzalez! Alright, gentlemen, we went over the rules in the back. Any last minute questions? Alright, fight clean, fight fair, defend yourselves at all times, obey my commands at all times. Touch gloves, go back to the corner, let's do this. We've got the Death Roll Higgins in the ring. Yep, coming out of, um, Jackson Submission Fighting, same school as um, Diego Sanchez. Uh, going up against, uh, formerly, they call him the Maniac. Sweet. Oh. Heavy hands. This little overhand left. Both fighters kind of measuring themselves right here. I understand the death roll coming from, of course. Down under. Down under, like the, uh, the crocodiles do to their, uh, their uh, prey. And speaking of that, speaking of Crocodile, his coach is a bodyguard for Steve Early, the Crocodile Hunter, that's what they say. Nice little trip there. A little close to the ring. Good job by pulling back in by Gonzalez. Kind of stalemate position right here. These guys just kind of just kind of appeared, kind of feeling each other out. They're kind of jockeying for position, looking for a leg trip. After a while, maybe the referee might want to break these out. Oh, so nice. Took some effect right there. Got a little throwing shot. Oh, went for a throw. Failed there, go back to guard. I was trying to make some space here. Let's see if um, he's got anything on his back. Higgins does. Of course, Fernando knows, uh, known for his uh, boxing ability and his hands. Dropping the elbows. Goes nice, quick arm over there. Good That's sized guy. Quick, quick hips. Yep. Over off right here. Okay. Sucking that single there. Suck it in, maybe. Uh, he's got blood from the. Uh, Right eye of the death row. One minute to go. Looks like he took a good shot. It's, at least it's underneath the eye, so it's not going to hinder the vision. Exactly. But of course, anytime getting a. It looks like a lot of. Anytime getting a, a cut on the head, a lot of blood. Nice little leg trip there. Let's see if we can steal this round. I don't think it, not a lot was happening, but um, Gonzalez did pepper him a little bit from the top there. And also cause some visible damage. This guy's working. Pretty good, pretty good work uh, movement for his size, death roll. He's got a fifty out. He's trying to rain down some punches. Not, not a lot are landing though. It's gonna, Looks like a lot, of, a lot of punches, not a lot of landing. Just pounded and pounded, trying to get one to trying to get one to connect. Fernando doing a good job of, of defending, keeping those arms up. He goes for a key lock right here, but he abandons it. Oh, nice. Almost goes for the arm bar. Saved by that bell. Good positioning, Megan, to finish that round, but um, not a lot of damage. 
like Gonzalez did a little more uh, damage at the position he was when he was on top. We're going back to a uh, replay. Uh, maybe right. see what happens to that cut. A nice Mike. deep cut there. He's kind of jogging for position. Oh, nice, nice little knee. knee. Nice leg trip. Kind of falls into the corner. That kind of saves him right there. He always kind of fires back when he has an opportunity. Trying to figure out where that cut came in. Now he's down. Here's where most of the damage of the right. fight came down. Probably right from the elbow. That's it. Good opportunity by Gonzalez to, to take advantage of that guard, posturing up. Maybe it's kind of pays him back at the end in that mild position, but not a lot of damage done to Gonzalez. And a nasty cut on Higgins' eye. This is when you want a good cut, man. They can stop that cut there. It's, uh, it's going to save, and of course, going to start to swell up. Nice shot of that. Nice not and deep, kind of shoving that near sport. That's Extreme Wars X1 Judge Fitte. That is mixed martial arts. That's the kind of stuff you get. Some gobbledygook in there. I mean, you got. I mean, these guys. That's what they're going for. You, you gotta love blood, and you gotta love it when it's combined with the mixed martial arts. That was a vicious elbow. So we get was international fight Australia. Nice. It's in. Good job by Gonzalez of getting the underhook there to kind of negate the tech takedown. Throw some heels. Elbow, elbow, inside. The fighter's kind of trading those knees on the inside. It's probably so difficult to get solid legs and not get a groin shot. Those guys try to come in, jockey for position. Kind of a stalemate in the corner. Oh, almost goes for that. It's a, again, hard one. Good job by Higgins. I got to stay down. Almost gets Kimura there, but kind of guts out There's, of that. Not sure if that, no. Still blood coming from uh, the death row. Dropping some elbows. Trying to return the favor. Got a full mount again. See if he picks his punches a little better now. Kind of early into the round, so he's uh, can Fernando survive. He's being a little more selective, not wasting yep. his energy. He's kind of throwing punches. Ah, this is back. Nice. Oh. The hooks in. Looking for a reverse naked. Kind of scoot out. Because he got it in there. Oh, oh. Got it. Good transition wow. by Higgins right there. Great movement. One, uh, again, as a mixed martial artist, always thinking ahead. Right midpoint of the round. Got his opportunity. And Dawes turned his back. Got his hooks in. Finished with a nice Matalea reverse naked choke. Taking it back to the replay, Mike. Oh. That's a nice little knee. And after that, you can see Gonzalez kind of kept his head up after that. So you know that kind of stung. Goes a little free. failed. Take down attempt. Good job of Higgins, Higgins by keeping his hips kind of squared off. And again, he was picking his punches. Look for his opportunity. And he finally kind of gave his back. And uh, Higgins definitely uh, made the most of the position. Got his hooks in. Sunk Got the right choke in. nice in. Nice, nice and, and tight. tight. Stretched him out. Nice technical vi victory by Higgins. Let's take uh, into the ring. Ladies and gentlemen, at 129 in the second round, the winner by rear naked choke from Australia, Ozzy, 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 Oi, 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 Dan, Jim